You need five times more uh, renewable energy, renewable electricity, uh, to create um, an, uh, the amount of e-fuels that you would need to directly electrify a car uh, via a battery for the same amount of driving or the same amount of distance to travel. So therefore, given the scarce amount of renewable energy, that, and, and we need this renewable energy to decarbonize the grid, and also to actually then think, okay, where are we most efficiently going to use uh, these e-fuels? These e if, if they're so energy inefficient and so expensive to make, there's actually other sectors of the economy, shipping, aviation and heavy industry that don't have any other viable uh, decarbonisation alternatives in the short term. fuels into a legislation regulating engines would mean the law would be simply un unenforceable. It is impossible, not feasible to monitor what drivers, what fuel drivers are putting into their cars, uh, especially over the lifetime of a, of a car.